What's going on guys? My name is Triforce Addiction. Welcome back to another video. So today we are starting the Let's Play series for the Cosmic Shake. So it has officially come out. I was going to do this earlier, but I figure I get like a full, uh, I'm like a full amount of like sleep time. So I can, you know, like work at my maximum. It's, it's absolutely crazy. I can't believe it. I heard like a lot of people did get their, uh, their copies of the game. And unfortunately for me, I was never really able to do that. Um, I, I don't even know how to request. I, I probably could have gotten a review copy and played this earlier, but it, it is what it is. But anyways, right now I'm currently playing on the Xbox Series S, as you guys can see. I want to get as high quality as possible. Of course, obviously, I'm going to make videos on the Switch version as well. I did end up like scrounging enough money to buy that one as well. So yeah, actually, let's, let, let's just get started because like I'm really excited to see what happens. It kind of just pulls you in. Okay. Wow. Hold on, let me uh let me go to my controls real quick. I actually need to make the sensitivity a little bit faster. Gameplay settings, standard, standard, invert vertical. I think that's how I do it. Uh camera shake on. I mean I don't mind. Uh where is HUD's always visible. Objectives always visible. Show tutorials. Where's the... Don't they have, like, the sensitivity setting? Um, hold on. I think it's, like, probably in video settings. Okay. Don't they have, like, a, a setting to, like, kind of, like, increase the... The sensitivity? Like at least for when for the camera settings, dude. That's that's really disappointing. Wow, I I legit thought there's some sort of uh. Like this can't be all of it, right? So I guess I'm just stuck with this low sensitivity. Oh, that kind of sucks. Oh, that that's that's kind of jarring, but it's whatever. I think they'll probably add something like that later on, in an update. But wow, look how look how crazy Bikini Bottom looks. I mean, it doesn't it doesn't even look the same anymore. Like there's no like shouldn't there be downtown Bikini Bottom and Jellyfish Fields? Like that's so weird. It's so crazy. Who who's what the hell is that up there? Okay, never mind. Let's just let's just go talk to Squidward. Let's see what happens. Or let's go talk to uh Okay. Okay, okay. Press Y. Okay. I am pressing Y. Oh, I forgot Y is different. Okay, yeah, yeah. It's because I'm used to the switch. Find a way at to Sandy's tree dome. Okay. Let's go talk to Kieran. You know, his voice is so different compared to, like, the original. Like, that that's one thing, like, I've noticed that the, inf the inflection, or I guess the inflection of, like, how his voice is from, like, from, like, you know, 2003 all the way to now, it's so different. Like, that's why Spongebob, like, has such a deeper voice. And I think it's probably because of, like, Tom Kenny's age, maybe. Like, he's gone older. Okay. Okay, cool. So that's how you jump. Obviously, it's A. 
But it's it's worth that you had to actually learn the ability. I mean, it should kind of already be included. Can you talk to these people? Yeah, you can. <laughs> at least they still have the shady shoals, am I right? I wonder who's at fault here. Probably that guy. <laughs> you know, actually, I, I don't blame her for thinking that. I mean, like, Sponge... Well, like, Spongebob wasn't really sp responsible for the robots, but still. Okay, clean up Sandy's tree dome, okay. Do I like have to go inside or? Oh, okay, okay, yeah. I forgot there's like an object objective thing kind of like telling you what's going on. Uh, how to spin attack. Okay, so basically press X, okay. So I'm assuming the controls are going to be more or less the same as it was with Battle for Bikini Bottom. There we go. Okay, let's go talk to her. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, why is there an alarm clock outside? Oh yeah, we had to we had to go to Oh, oh look, look, look a switch. Oh shit. I'm glad that they like you know, I've been like seeing a lot of trailers or gameplay trailers of like different switches. But I originally thought that like they did away with these types of switches. But no, they actually brought them back. Okay, that's cool. See what happens. My God, SpongeBob! I mean, Patrick looks so different. Honestly, he kind of—he kind of looked like a, a serial killer. Oh, look, it's the robot. <laughs> it's good that they brought that guy back and it, with the exact same ability. Can I have it? What, this old piece of magic and mystery? Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Madame Cassandra, purveyor of long lost treasures of the seven seas. For those on a budget. Magic bubbles soak. Breathe Dude, these, these cutscenes are dreams. so good. Oh my god, I, I love that. I love that shit. Like, that's the loading screen? That's awesome. Oh, is this what turns up into a balloon? Thanks, 
but they just look like normal bubbles. It looks like it's not really doing anything. Oh, okay. It's because, like, they were blowing it right now. I'm just like, what the hell does, like, what is it actually doing? Oh, wow. Okay, so that's how everything, okay. Oh, so everything's, like, in shambles now. Manure. Oh, my God. What happened to this place? Even like even Patrick's voice is different. It's so like it's crazy seeing like the differences Okay, so it's not that's a bad thing. It's just it just how like the voice acting has evolved over time All right, let's get these little balls. I Think this is like the currency or something Oh yeah, like basically. Yeah, like his his whole rock is basically like sunk. Or maybe it's somewhere else, I'm not sure, but yeah. Okay, how to ground pound. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, the ground pound's fast. I'm usually like I usually wait for him to like have the bubble and just like pound then. Okay, let's go over here. Okay, Patrick. It's a little creepy, but whatever. Okay, interesting. I wonder if this guy talks. <laughs> that is pretty cool. <laughs> Like all the all the citizens are here actually. That's that's awesome. All right, let's hit the switch real quick. Okay. How to glide? Press A and then oh yeah, the crusty crap pizza is the pizza for you and me. All right. Okay, so let's uh Wow, you descend pretty hard with this thing. Oh my god, I think you descend a little bit too much. I don't think it was always like that. Oh my god, for that, that's such a cursed image. All right, first set of enemies to kill. I like how it has to like remind me over and over again. How to dodge. Okay. Oh yeah, this is the cartwheel move that I've been seeing. Okay. Okay, interesting, getting the hang of it. Oh, 
restaurant is tipped over and our poor little spot is missing. Correct. Oh no! Sorry, Plankton. We'll make things right again. You have to fix this before someone besides me can take advantage of this peon. Correct. Why are you repeating yourself? Is your hard drive skipping again? In correct. Okay. I'm glad they added crying animations too. Something tells me not to trust this person. I don't know why. Like something tells me, like the way the way she stuttered in one of those voice dialogues. Like she's like, "Oh, uh, yeah, I can help you." Like, I, I feel like she wanted this to happen. How to how to costume shop? Okay, use the shop to equip and purchase SpongeBob costumes. Unlock costumes by playing the story. Collect doubloons and completing side quests. Use cosmic jelly to purchase unlocked costumes. Okay, cool. Interesting. Oh, interesting. Uh, so where is the costume shop? Is it just inside here? Wait, where is it? Or is it just... Oh, it's, it's in here. Okay. Yeah, don't I have like these uh, downloadable ones? This is pretty cool. Okay, yeah, that one looks fucking cursed. Okay, let's uh, I actually want to use the robot SpongeBob one. I think this one would be pretty cool. Oh, dude, that is sick. Okay. Oh, they even have the cash register and everything. <laughs> Can you hit this tumbleweed? Oh, that's cool. Cause to break all this stuff too. I wonder what they're saying here. Are they even saying anything at all? Isn't that Fred? <laughs> they don't even care. They tipped over the chum bucket as well. So I guess like the other stuff is gonna be like accessible later on. Uh, at least we get to see Pat, uh, Mr. Krabs' house now. That's cool. All right, so let's get into the first world. Oh wow, that is so mind blowing. I, I love the wow, love the effects of this portal. Okay, let's go. See what happens. Can you move here? Oh yeah, you can. Oh, never mind. Oh, finally we got introduced to the first world. Nice. This is uh the Western Jellyfish Fields, I think. Oh, here's like one of the cutscenes of the trailer. There's mystery or Debbie, however you want to call it. Can you just like... Oh my god. Oh, 
want to talk to the sheriff in Manta Fe. <laughs> Manta Fe. All right, guys. So we're gonna end off the episode right here because obviously um, we're kind of already like we are, we're we're already like twenty minutes in. So I think it's best to just like save this as like the introduction, and then like next time we'll start off the very first level. So, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like. Make sure to subscribe for some more cosmic shade content. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>